A true example of black power in America can be described as a city with a black mayor, a black police chief, a black fire chief, and a black city government with a majority black population. The city of Dalton, Illinois has all of that with a population that's 92% black, about 20,000 people live in this city with an average income of about $24,000 a year. And yet the mayor makes over 300K a year in a city where the mayor's job should be a volunteer job. Many outsiders wanna make excuses for this blatant corruption by saying things like, oh, black people ain't the only ones that's crooked politicians. So let me address that sentiment right now. Number one, we don't have too many black cities in this country that have a true black power structure. Number two, there's a disproportionate amount of criminal behavior in disrespect to the citizens of Dalton. The mayor has totally neglected her fiduciary duties. And I haven't heard one fellow Democrat speak out on this behavior. No matter how you want to dress up this pig, but we need to prove that we can govern ourselves. I will be breaking down how people like Miss Hingard comes to prominence in the black community and fleece the people every time. In doing so, I have to acknowledge what's refreshing about Donald Trump. Donald Trump is a rich, self-made man who doesn't need the money. He entered politics to actually help the people. This is my main point. I was hoping that many of our rich black leaders that don't need the money can step into our cities and help us out. Tell me, wouldn't that be great? It's speculated that the mayor of Dalton has stolen millions. Like a real low budget street criminal, she's gotten some advice of how to hide the money. Now she's just awaiting her lockup date. I think that a lot of black people learn to be a person of high charisma and low character from the black church. Many black churches put on charismatic shows with lots of singing and lectures. They know how to move the crowd, but they deliver absolutely nothing. Who do you think votes in a town like Dalton? The church people or the non-church people? Because of this selfish, unqualified mayor, this city has been set back at least 20 years. I haven't heard one person mention the most important thing, the plight of the children. The future for these kids have been washed away. Will they be willing to pay the price for so many non-existent promises? You see, church leaders like absolute rule. They focus on things like money and skin color. Not enough focus on accountability, character, values, respect, and it's all for the love of our children. Another democratic black city that has failed its people miserably.